Greetings, immortal fools, and welcome to episode 30 of the Sponge Ghoul Community News. My name is Patty Sponge, and I will be your host. Your ghost host! <laughs> I'm gonna get him to stop with the voice. This month is the most of ghosts, monsters, skeletons, and getting fat for too much candy. Of course, not all candy is to be eaten. Some of it is to be watched, just like the following news. Mr. Squarepants, how do you explain all this success? The schedule for this month's new spot episodes took a spooky turn, with the four planned episodes airing on the last two Sundays of October, rather than all airing daily on a specific week. On October 21st was The Night Patty by Luke Fuchsia, in which Spongebob works a night hour shift at the Krusty Krab, and The Grill is Gone by Andrew Goodman, where Mr. Krabs and Spongebob has to waste a group of kids who stole the grill. Secondly and finally, on October 28th was Appointment TV by Andrew Goodman, involving Spongebob trying to get home to watch a long lost Moe Man and Bonnie Boy episode, and Bubble Town by Andrew Goodman and John Trebek, in which Spongebob visits Bubble Buddy in his titular hometown. This schedule has also been confirmed for all episodes airing in November, with more info code on this index month's news. This just in, new details regarding the upcoming third Spongebob film, It Is Wonderful Sponge, were announced at a view conference in Turin, Italy. The movie will be an origin story, focusing on Spongebob meeting his friends for the first time at a summer camp. The film will be completely computer generated, with no 2D animation planned to be present. This isn't the first time the Spongebob has set into CGI, as the second Spongebob film, Sponge Out of War's second half, consisted entirely of live action CGI. Veteran film composer Hans Zimmer has also been confirmed to close the film's soundtrack. It's a Wonderful Sponge is planned to physical release on July 17th, 2020. We're sorry, but your kind isn't allowed here. At the beginning of this month, a staff application was held for a new fry cook to join the staff and graphics team. The winning applicant was Local Aquatic, currently making him the newest SBC user to become staff. Of course, you know what's coming next. <laughs> Octoberfest has returned for the dead once again, and this time, it's seeking to be the biggest yet. The Frankensteins and vampires are at it again. Jeopardy, Wheel of Fortune, Dunces and Dragons, SBC music parties, Spongecraft tournaments, Who Done It, costumes, story and art content, and let's not forget Hokey. For this year, there are three new mini games. Apple Bobbing has users Bob for Apple's turn to blooms. Ghost Catches has users catch ghosts to catch to blooms. And Trick or Treat has users knock on Spongebob characters' doors hoping to get a nice treat! On top of this, over 50 iFish items have been made available for this event, including over 25 new items. Do you think you're brave enough to have fun? Octoberfest 2018 ends October 31st. Which it has now. Cresticles 1. Here's one you might know. <clears throat> this episode's featured spin-off is Bikini Bottom Nature Watch by OWM. Yeah, I know it's not horror Halloween related, but just pretend it is, okay? The series focuses on the research of explorer dastardly Dan Damselfish, as he discusses the natural habitats of the starfish, squid, single-celled organism, and more to come. Who knows, maybe you might be the focus of one of Dan's adventures. You can find the link to this spin-off in the links below. If you have any suggestions for future featured spin-off or lists, leave a comment or send a PM to the series editor. I'll give him a week. I'll give him 11 minutes. Today's featured episode, and I will be blinking surprised if you don't see this coming, Skeddy Pants from Season 1, written by Paul Tibbet and Peter Burns. Why did we choose this episode? Well... Is it a blimmin' obvious? In this episode, Spongebob tries to conquer his fears of being scared of Halloween by dressing up as a ghost and attempting to scare others himself. Of course, when there's something scary, there's always something scarier. You can find the discussion thread for this episode in the links below. That's all we have time for today. So to keep up with the series, make sure to subscribe, leave a comment in the main thread, or join the SBC News Club. Thanks so much for watching, and... Good night. Ha 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 